Good morning. I have my morning coffee. I got my coffee since going. Let's get into a haul. I have a bag full of clickly clee. Y'all know it was free. Let's get into it. These grads this month started off with a dream bright piece of a body care, a mini. So I opted for the mini shower gel because remember I told y'all I love the scent, the night blooming orchid, the crystallized vanilla, the sapphire berries. I do like the scent, um, but do I need it in a full size? No, I was going to get it in the minis anyway. So I opted for that piece along with the dream bright piece. We also got the EDP of the mini perfume, which was good because I totally forgot to grab this when it was $8 and I was going to use a reward on it. So again, that's that Night Blooming Orchid, crystallized vanilla and sapphire berries per se. Another part of our gratis, which took me a long time to bring this home because this was over in our offsite, we have After Dark. So down here, I've already did a review on the candle for After Dark, and it's a little more citrusy. It's a little more clean, but it is cologne. -y. So on this one, I wouldn't use this on me as a unisex scent, but it'll be gifted to somebody. Spice, bergamot, amber, and tonka. Remember, tonka is the baby of a vanilla bean pod and a tobacco flower. It smells really good, though. So from the holiday traditions, we got to pick from a slice of body here. So I went with the ice sugar plum. Um, these are normally not my scent notes that I gravitate toward. The sparkling sugar plum snowdrop petal with marshmallow. This is a good pairing for that whipped berry, that sweet cotton candy vibe that fallen, um, not fallen flurries, fireside flurries give. So you have fireside flurries from last year and you're looking for a blend. This would be it. You're just going to be overly sweet. It's not really my thing, but you know, it was gratis. So here it is. And let me show you the price too, because this is 16. Yeah, it's 16.50. So you can get it with a reward. So can the aftercare piece. And then last but not least, they gifted us with a single wick candle. And I went for the strawberry snowflake. Um, Two of them in my room does just fine. And remember, I didn't do a dedicated review on this. So this is whip. Um, like a whipped cream, you have the whipped strawberries, you have the bergamot, which is giving you a citrus note to this candle. So it's going to give you like a winterized ice. I think I saw it. Ice makes a strawberry gum. Like, you know, when you bite down on it, you get the berry, but you get the minty pieces. Almost like that. But it is a very close call to strawberry pound cake. Just as not as much bakery, but it is giving you some citrus to cut it. If you're tired of the pound cake like me. So not bad in a single week. And remember that sale is coming up this weekend on these. And you got the matching here hands. in this corner. I had several rewards flashing at me about to expire. Don't need any more body care. So I opted for soaps, although the sale is coming. But listen, I ain't had to spend nothing for it. So it's still going to be free. You have the Iris Blossom Winter Cedarwood Glimmer and Snowflake. Y'all know I'm a sucker for masculine unisex scent. So that white Iris and Cedarwood is bay. And I had to cap it off with a signature soap. Again, the Dream Bright, the Crystallized Vanilla, the Night Blooming Orchid, the Sapphire Berries. Because it's a signature scent, why not? And you all, part of my empties for the end of October, I ran through that single wick like the Tomb Raider and halfway through a three wick. I didn't even bring no pictures or anything of the three wick because I did the review off of the single. And we have that 35 to 45 year old bad boy after dark himself. Again, said no, so if you did not catch it, that's the Spice Bergamot Amber and Tonka. These are so freaking Next, In that gratis pile, we got to choose from a Christmas pocket bag. And I went with Bright Christmas Morning. I'm not too picky on those. And this is a part of it. This is the, the sleigh, the dog in the sleigh. Um, that's a part of our uniform. We're in our red aprons now. So that's a part of your gratis. So this is my gratis haul, y'all. Tell you, with that job, you always go bring home free stuff. And then this is my freebie with rewards. I have some other things in here, too, that somebody purchased for me. So, yay, it's me, because I keep the free. And sidebar, August 2nd, when I did my fall soap haul, 
you all, I have been purchased soap since then. Remember, I told you sometimes you got to put yourself on punishment. So this will make actually 12 weeks that I didn't walk out the job with any soaps that I purchased. Again, yes, I blew a $16.50 reward, but at this point, it is what it is. 12 weeks, y'all, I'm, I'm doing good. I, I'm going to say I'm going to no soap buy for a year, and I'm going to stick to that. I'm going to stick beside it. I'm going to stick beside it. about some 50% off wallflowers plus a coupon that I kept saying, I'm going to get them, I'm going to get them. And my store manager got them for me. You all, out here in my open concept, I have three plugs. One in the kitchen that makes four. One in the hallway that makes five. One in the beauty room that's six. One in my bedroom that's seven. One in each bed and bathroom that's eight, that's nine. So I have a total of nine throughout this apartment. And I always change them out about the second of the month. So uh, walk in the woods is what I originally wanted. That's that peppercorn, that cedarwood, that patchouli. I like to blend. I originally wanted four of these with four autumn woods. But I screwed around and let autumn woods sell out. So that's that on that. And then I opted for Cuddle Weather, which is that gingerbread tea note, that real comforting, warming note. Um, I hadn't even did the candle review for you all on this yet, but this is cinnamon gingerbread tea and a cozy blanket feel. So I figured these would be good in the bedroom or the bathroom. And then we have that strong pumpkin clove, which is warm, comforting. Uh, clove, cinnamon, nutmeg, fresh pumpkin. This would be good for the three out here in the open concept or either the kitchen because it is very scrounged. So, yeah, I know y'all like, girl, somebody at the store always buying you something. Well, listen, I, I'm good at my job, okay? And I don't ask for much and I handle business up front. So, that's that on that. And I'm going to see y'all on the next video. Um, Probably another haul or a review. But just rock with me, y'all. Bye.